I need to speak to Carly. Following up on Jocelyn's kidnapping. Looking for Sonny and Jackson. Yeah, I, you know, I should have called you, but I was too busy putting Jocelyn to sleep. It, uh, there was no kidnapping. Huh. You got a new name for it? Yeah, it was a misunderstanding, oh. you know. Mercedes and I, we kept missing each other. We couldn't, I guess, the storm. We just couldn't get in touch with each other. Okay, can we forget the phony cover stories? Sonny's out for Jax's blood, and he's gonna draw some, okay, if we don't get to Jax first? I don't know anything that could help you. I kind of figured you'd say something like that, so I put on an APB on both of them. What the hell'd you do that for? Carly, you can't protect Jax or Sonny this time, and one way or another, it's all coming to a head tonight. I help you here, Carly. <sighs> I figured you'd want the father of your child alive. I want my daughter to have her father and her life, but now thanks to your knee-jerk cop reaction, Jocelyn's only gonna see Jax through bars or glass. What is it with you wanting to put everyone I love in prison? Well, I figured prison was better than dead. Wow, you're, you know, you're making way too much out of this. Really? Carly, you know what Sonny has in store for Jax? Sonny, uh, Sonny goes off, okay? He gets crazy, he goes off half cock, but then he calms down, it's fine. Really? At the hospital, you were saying something completely different. You were all panicked and freaked out that, that Sonny was gonna kill Jax. That's still a very real possibility. Jocelyn's fine, okay? She's home and she's fine. Just because she's back in your care does not mean danger has passed. She's trying to be positive. She's trying to change her story, she No. Sonny's hurt, okay? He's just hurt. Yeah, he's all messed up over the breakup with Brenda. He's gonna take it out on somebody. He's not gonna do anything stupid. Carly, he already came at me once, okay? I walked away. I guarantee you, Jax will not. That's why I put out the APB. We gotta stop Sonny before he finds Jax, or Jocelyn won't have a father. I don't understand. You're not related to Jocelyn. Why do you care about her custody situation? Jax violated the terms of your agreement. He kidnapped her. No, she didn't call the police. It's still a police matter. I, I said it was a misunderstanding, okay? Sonny's in the middle of this. Did Sonny ask you? No. Okay, and you're not gonna back off. Why? Because you, as always, know what's best for everybody else. Right? I'm objective. No, Sonny doesn't want you in this. I don't want you in this. I'm pretty sure Jack doesn't want you in this. Too late. It's not too late to call off the APB, okay? Let me find my husband. I'll talk Jax into leaving town. There won't be a Jax to talk to if I don't get to Sonny first. Okay, look, I don't have the best relationship with my father, but I don't want Michael and Morgan and Christina to have to watch him get sent up for murder. Okay, so now I don't care about my kids. I don't care how this affects them. Is no, that it? No, I just think you want me out of here. And the truth of the matter is, Sonny's in no mind frame to be reasoned with. He means to kill Jax. I'm trying to avoid that happening. And putting them both in prison is the solution here? Well, better than letting them wander around until they collide with each other. Just back off! Back off and let my family handle this! Can't do that, Carly. I'm not going to sit my hands while Sonny blows your husband's brains out, okay? I'm warning you. Stay out of my way. <laughs> hey, look. Carly may not like it, but she knows you have a job to do. Like hell I do. No, she won't interfere. All right. I'm going to hold you to that. What's that? Are you trying to handle me now? Uh, I don't know if I'm up for that. Seems like a lot of work for a thankless task. I'm scared. Okay, I'm really scared. Look, you're allowed. But don't forget to be thankful, too. Look, you, you got your baby girl. Carly, one thing at a time. Tired, boss. Maybe we should talk about whatever this is in the morning. Jax thinks he's got a free pass, like I'm not gonna make a move. He's wrong. We're gonna make a move tonight. Well, Jax is probably on his way out of the country. He's gonna now. go to the plane. Plane's gonna have engine problems. He's gonna try to find a mechanic. When he does, that's when you grab him. You got to the jet? I manipulated the situation. I see. You want me to take Jax out to the Pine Barrens? No, that's the first place cops are gonna look. I wanna do this myself. What you're gonna do is you're gonna... You're gonna take him to the boat. And then we're gonna sail. Where? It doesn't really matter, because what's gonna happen is he's gonna fall overboard. Right, it's gonna be a very, very terrible accident. And when the cops find the body, they're gonna just think he was trying to take off somewhere. You sure? Are you sure you wanna ask me at this moment if I'm sure? I'll meet you at the boat. Huh. You and I have some unfinished business. Carly got Jocelyn back. 
Jax is, uh, I don't know, maybe he's out of town or whatever, and it's over. That easy, huh? What about the part where you assaulted a police officer? You mean when I punched my son? Were you pretty proud of that? No. Yeah, you, you always used to say that, that there's a difference between you and your stepfather. You were better than him. But the truth is, son, you're exactly no, like him. No, different. Because, see, I didn't slap you around when you were a kid. I didn't oh. lock you in a closet and turn oh. off the lights. Oh, you know so because I mean? I'm a grown-up, it's okay because I can fight back? I punched you. You got in my way. Huh. And you, you're in my way right now. So we'll just, you know. Thank you. It's great. Are you kidding me? No. Michael Corinthos Jr., you are under arrest.